Hello everyone, I've got a new video. It seems that Rockstar's changed the way of verifying uh, game data files on GTA 5. So I'm going to show you the slightly new way of doing it. It's sort of similar but slightly different. So what you want to do is you want to find your game. It could be on your desktop. Mine's in a folder. You right click your game. Open file location. Click anywhere on the white bit so nothing's highlighted. Hold shift and right click. Now it will say open PowerShell window here. The old method doesn't work anymore. Which I've just found out. Alright, so first you type CMD and then enter and now you type play GTA V space dash verify enter it now you'll get a admin message coming up you have to have your game running as admin by the way uh, just press yes sign in if that's what you've got to do Signed you in. And there you go, it's verifying the game data. Before it used to be, uh, when you right clicked in your game directory, it would come up with open command window here. But it's slightly different to this PowerShell. Let's just start coming out on uh, Windows 10. It's only just been put there. So I have to find a new way of doing it. So hopefully this helps. It will verify your uh, game, it will fix any bugs, it will make sure the game's up to date. I do this regularly just to keep the game running as it should. Takes about 20 minutes to do. Depending on your internet connection, because it's actually connected to Rockstar services here, it's like downloading files. I have to try and talk quietly because it's like 2 o'clock in the morning over here. <laughs> I 
it gets about halfway along the line and then uh, it'll automatically load the game afterwards. This doesn't work on uh, Steam version, you have to do it with uh, another method, which I've also got on my channel. I had the old method of this on my channel as well, I've still got it, but it doesn't work anymore. You have to do it this way, which is like slightly different. It's almost done. It was like 10 minutes for me. When it gets to halfway, it like opens the game straight away. Got let's uh, done and then end the video. So you can see how it goes. I'm hoping that my microphone and uh, the mouse is showing up on the screen. I'm using the uh, NVIDIA experience to record this. And should be about ready to start. There you go.
Alright, thank you for watching and I hope this is of some help to you. I'll update my video if anything else changes. And if you're a Steam user, please uh, have a look on my channel for the Steam video. I don't have many videos, so it'll be easy to find. I've only got like 10 videos or something. <laughs> Talk to you later.